In the Dymo ID software, you'll be working in three basic areas, the home screen, label editor, and data grid. The home screen is the main interface for Dymo ID. The home screen is where you can select the label application, label maker, or label cartridge, manage files, and customize the settings. The label applications available to select from will be displayed on the home screen. Note that the label applications that are compatible with the currently selected label cartridge appear at the far left of the home screen, while label applications that are not compatible appear with the caution symbol to the far right of the home screen. Once you select the label application, the label edit area will appear. The label edit area is similar to the label editor on the XTL300 and XTL500. Once a label application is selected from the home screen, the label edit area will appear in order to create and edit a label. Most of the label editors share some of the same features shown here. Serialize, ruler to change your unit of measurement, zoom, scroll through multiple labels, find and fix any errors, print, cut, copy, paste, undo, redo, and clear. One important feature for Dymo ID that does not appear on the XTL label makers is the data grid. The data grid is available for most label editors where you can import data or map data to the objects on the label. The data grid has the following features. Import, export, recall, change data, refresh data, automatically map columns, clear all mappings, add and delete. The Dymo ID user manual further explains these features if you would like to learn more.